this is the most beautiful country in the world and you can go for an internship there because EPFL University has announced their engineering internship for 2026. Yes, you heard it right, you will be getting a stipend of 2 lakh rupees and how you need to apply, what documents you need to submit, what is motivation letter, everything will be cleared in this particular video. The complete application process and the benefits will be talked inside the video so make sure you watch the video till the end and make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss these kind of internship opportunities. EPFL is a Swiss Federal Institute of Technology of Lausanne and this particular institute has announced their Excellence in Engineering Summer Internship. If I'll give you a brief overview, you will be going there, you will be doing research internship under their faculty and the best part about this internship is you get multiple Area, you can apply into multiple areas. You can apply into three areas at one time so you have more chances to get selected. That is the overview. If I talk about the application deadline, you have like 10-12 days left if the video is published around 19-20th October during Diwali. 1st of November is the last date and the internship duration would be 8-12 to 12 weeks. It will be like 2 months or 3 months and per month you will be getting a stipend of 1800 Swiss francs which is insane. 2 lakh rupees. Eligibility file talk about you have to be in your third year or final year. You have completed your first and second year at least. Applicant must be enrolled in bachelor's or master's program at the time of application. So the time when you will be applying you would be in a bachelor's or master's degree and completed at least the second year of your college. Field of study should be engineering, sciences, technology, for example, you can be from computer science, electrical, mechanical, so any engineering branch is eligible. Even the uh, sciences student, material sciences, bachelors of science, BCA student, MC student, they can also apply in this particular thing, uh, in this particular internship. PhD students are not eligible. There is no English proficiency certificate required. Many of the students face this difficulty while applying for NTU that, uh, you know, they were asking for English certification, IELTS or uh, TOEFL certification but this in this particular internship it's not required at all. Now moving on to the stipend and the benefits part. Stipend is 1800 Swiss franc which is 2 lakh rupees in Indian currency. They will help you with the flight tickets. They will cover all the travel cost from Switzerland to Switzerland. Uh, whichever country you are going from. Partial visa cost will also be covered by them. Assistance for visa will also be given by them because visa getting the visa is one of those difficult things that uh, you know things have uh, even visa assistance will also be provided by this particular organization and housing and living expenses will also be covered during this internship so it's a fully funded funded internship where you don't have to care about anything you just have to make sure that you apply with the with your best application so that you can get selected in this particular internship. If I talk about the research fields, see all the cutting edge technology fields are there, but all the engineering fields are also there because it's a university. So all the other fields are also covered. For instance, uh, advanced manufacturing, analog circuit design, robotics, bioengineering, nanotechnology, optics, internet of things, IoT, mechanical design, quantum computing, artificial intelligence biotechnology all these fields if you are from engineering you are all covered you can apply go ahead but you can apply into three fields at a time i would recommend all the computer science students to apply for artificial intelligence machine learning and data science field because they have the maximum probability to get selected in this followed by this application process you just have to go to the epfl internship application page i'll just go there and i'll show you how you can apply you always face this difficulty which particular thing to fill, what is the pro, you know, sometimes you don't find the specific college, so and so forth. This time I'll help you with filling the complete application. Prepare documents such as uh, CV transcript and the motivation letter because these are very much required. Select three research areas that match your interest. Submit the online application before 1st of November. That's all. Wait for the result. If you will be shortlisted, you will hear back from the um, university and you just have to travel tra prepare for travel and visa so this is the application page this is the overview page you just go to the apply button and here are the timelines mentioned click on apply now you can read about more about the faqs the laboratory or the details from the university mentioned here using the links
सो हियर आर द डॉक्यूमेंट मैंशन डेट यू नीड टू सबमिट अ स्कैन ऑफ यूर पासपोर्ट अकेडमिक ट्रांसक्रिप्ट योर सी वी एंड योर रिसर्च स्टेटमेंट बेसिकली विच एवर रिसर्च टॉपिक्स यू पिक अप यू टॉक अबाउट इट यू यू नो द मोटिवेशन लेटर टू बी अ पार्ट ऑफ दैट रिसर्च फील्ड इंटर्नशिप राइट एंड देन ऑप्शनल डॉक्यूमेंट्स विच आर मैंशन यूर इफ यू आर अ बैचलर डिप्लोमा स्टूडेंट देन दीज डॉक्यूमेंट्स आर रिक्वायर्ड फ्रॉम योर साइड दिस गो नेक्स्ट एंड स्टार्ट फिलिंग दिस अनदर नेक्स्ट बाय मेकिंग दिस यू कैन रीड ऑल दीज थिंग्स ऑन योर ओन ओके मेल आई एल जस्ट क्विकली फिल दीज डिटेल्स फॉर यू गाइज सो दैट यू आर दिस इज स्मैम ई मेल नेशनैलिटी इंडियन सो दैट यू डोंट फील अ प्रॉब्लम नेक्स्ट टाइम Indian nationality next. Uh, okay, so this is the form, and we are. I believe there is. There should be okay. Country of university, university where your country enrolled, India, Ali Gar Muslim University, Anna University. So this is one of the problems that everyone faces every time. If your university name is not mentioned here, there are a lot of universities from India. Ah. Uh, but if your university name is now not mentioned what you will do is you will fill other so if you don't find your university name now you know you just have to fill other there it's completely fine they also know that there will be students who will be applying who are not uh, whose university is not on the list and that's the reason they have added the other option so make sure you fill the application and don't get confused if you still have doubt make sure you to comment down below i'll be more than happy to cover your doubts for more such amazing opportunities make sure to follow and subscribe this particular channel i'll meet you in the next one till then bye bye take care and make sure to like so that you we will reach a target of like 1000 likes for this particular video theek hai milte hain bye